Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm having my, my emotions on this situation are all over the place because I think it originally when people asked, you know, if you were sitting in the seat of a GM or you were a team president or you had some kind of influence over whether or not um, Deshaun Watson would be someone who you'd want on your football team, I immediately said no. And I continue to believe that this would have been a signing that I would have been against. And that's simply because here, look, you settled 24 of the 25 cases. You've maintained all along that you are innocent and you have not done anything wrong. I listened to Dan Orlowski talk about contrition and on compare it to, you know, to Michael Vick and saying that he should go ahead and seek maybe the advice of Michael Vick as far as how to re rehabilitate his image. Well, all along, Deshaun Watson has kind of like very, very honestly and very flippantly kind of expressed the fact that, you know what, I, I did not do anything wrong. And I believe, Greeny, you read a message today or you read a response today about the fact that he maintains he did nothing wrong. But you That's settled correct. 24 of 25 cases, right? Okay, exactly. Yes. So you, but you settled 24 of 25 cases. Well, if you've done nothing wrong, I guess, I guess in, in you know in the civil civil court, which I've never been a part of and don't ever plan on being a part of. I, I guess it's just you know this is what people do in order to just make problems go away, as they say. Just make it go away. Here, I'll give you this money and just make it go away. Well, this isn't going to go away. This isn't going to go away because there are some people who are going to be very, very emotional over the fact that there have been players who have been suspended for equals amount, equal amounts of games for far less, if you, you know, depending upon what your subjective opinion is, for far less transgressions compared to what this man has been accused of, although now seems to be over with as far as the civil process and the criminal process. I mean, 25 different women said you did something in order to compromise them and put them in situations that they were very uncomfortable with with a range of accusations within that. I mean, that, that, it's just mind-boggling to me that now, you know, quickly, you know, I think the conversation is going to turn to football and whether or not, you know, the Cleveland Browns are a viable Super Bowl candidate or a playoff candidate. When this, 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 this situation is going to bring up so many different emotions, just like it's bringing up in me, and I'm still trying to kind of process the fact that for all of this, for everything that this whole this case, for everything that this entire case entails, you got six games. You still are going to collect this year $45 million. You were not fined at all. No wonder. I mean, no, no wonder there's going to be a the, lot of emotions. I no think, wonder. Because I, 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 I that, that's, that's mind-blowing to me. Yeah. I, I think Go what's ahead, happened is, you know, right now you have a panel of some of the more articulate voices in sports. And many people are fumbling over words to try to talk about this in a fair manner. Yeah. And, and I think that's the, the largest issue. We, we, we can't assign guilt. And so now it's about our feelings. It's about our emotions. The, the facts are the facts is that this is a six game, a six game suspension for a man who says he's innocent, innocent that was accused by 24 different women of doing something. We don't get to judge that. We don't get to talk about that. And legally, I don't understand it enough to speak to that. But it is going to be about emotion. It's going to be about feeling. And this is going to be a very difficult situation to shush yeah, away even when Deshaun Watson is back. Yeah. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.